Hey guys, welcome back to the Fish Yacker YouTube channel. I'm Toast, and this one is for my ice fishing buddies. So guys, if you're new to the Fish Yacker YouTube channel, when I'm not on the water filming or showing kayak fishing hacks and rigging hacks with lures and stuff like that, I'm picking up a lot of inexpensive lures and accessories for fishing, trying to see if it's worth it or if it's total junk. I also said a couple weeks back that I'm going to try to start embarrassing myself ice fishing this year. I'm a southern boy, have no clue what I'm doing, but i got a bunch of friends who want to teach me how to do it. So uh, I figured, what the heck, I'll look online and see what kind of really cheap junk is out there for ice fishing, because I've barely done much of it growing up or ever before. And uh, here's one about as cheap as you're going to find much of anything for ice fishing online. I picked this up actually off of AliExpress for a dollar eighty six, and now it's gone up a few cents. So it's now starting at a dollar ninety one, and that's with free shipping. So a lot of these I don't even know how they do it. It's free shipping, I guess. Uh, these companies in China have an agreement with the U.S. Postal Service. And uh, if you saw a few days ago, I did a, a video for a one cent lure with free shipping. Anyway, let's take a look at it. It's an ice scoop. It's a skimmer, an ice fishing skimmer. Came in one of those cheap packages. I opened it up so I'd know what uh, I was looking at before I did the video. Otherwise, I haven't uh, taken a look at it closely. Just a bag. And here's a scoop in one of those uh, cellophane uh, envelopes. That's it. Right about a foot long. Uh, and as we get into it, here is... The post actually is on AliExpress. It's listed as Ice Scoop Skimmer with Wood Handle Metal Outdoor Ice Fishing Tackle Tool Accessories New 2008. Uh, this is based on the most inexpensive uh, skimmer ice scoop that you're going to find for ice fishing. This listing here is for two different styles. There's a plastic one and a wood and metal one. So I thought, you know, the wooden metal one looks pretty cool. It's $3.28, but heck, I, we're more about seeing how much junk we can find for totally, like, nothing at all and seeing if it's worth it or junk. So I got it for a dollar, I got it for what is now a dollar ninety one, and there is a picture of it. Not too much to this, actually. Uh, not too much at all. It's right about a foot or so-ish long, a little bit over that. It is hinged there, so it's more compact. It's got a nice little catch on it. It actually feels better than it looks. It's got a little click in it so it locks into place for the most part. Uh, the uh, scoop itself there is only probably about three and a half inches or so in diameter. Kind of flimsy. Uh, and the arm on it has some flex in it, but it actually does feel kind of reinforced. It's got a groove and a little uh, trench on either side, a little tunnel kind of, uh, to give it a little bit of, uh, you know weight, you know, benefits on it. And then the handle actually feels pretty good. It's EVA. So uh, the one thing on this compared to a lot of the metal stuff, your hand's not necessarily going to freeze right to it if it's really stinking cold outside. But it's not very long. It, I guess you bend it kind of like that. You can kind of get it at a vertical, at a 90 degree angle, fold it all the way up. That's kind of cool. So something really cheap. I mean, if you're looking for something really cheap, just as have like an, for an emergency or something like that, will it work? Definitely it will work. But, uh, probably worth about what I paid for it. You think something like this, you know, Dollar Tree quality stuff. But the grip on it, the EVA grip actually feels pretty good. And, uh, the arm on it feels better than what you would think it would be. Most of the flex in it seems to be right there where the EVA is connecting. But here, that's fairly strong. And then, uh, some play there in the, the scoop itself. But the fact that it actually does uh, have a couple of different positions on it you can lock in or fold it all the way up for travel and be compact. I don't know, it kind of flicks open pretty cool. <laughs> anyway, get what you pay for on this one. Not much to it. Sub $2, like the cheapest ice fishing uh, skimmer or scoop you're going to find. Uh, is it worth it? I think it's worth it. Uh, there's a little touch there too. It's actually got a little uh, nub on it here, a little tooth that actually fits up in that little track to keep it from like flexing or and stuff and breaking on you. Actually, it's nicer than what you'd expect for that price. So, 
If you really want something like this, there's tons of postings for this thing online on AliExpress, eBay, Wish, all over the place. I'll try to find some links for it and post them down below. So if you're taking a look at this actually on the YouTube channel, uh, you'll be able to go down below and click it. And if you haven't yet, guys, we ask you, uh, please give us that thumbs up, uh, like the video, you can subscribe to Fish Hacker YouTube channel, and you can follow me at John Ose on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, or follow the FishHacker.com channel on Facebook. But uh, we'll get some more of these coming. I got some other ideas and stuff, too. Uh, with the winter coming up, you might see me out on the ice, uh, slipping and falling and looking like a fool. And uh, I might get out kayak fishing, too. I might get out this weekend. And, uh, anyhow, get out there and try to catch some fish. We'll catch you on the water. Or ice, maybe. FishYacker.com The original kayak rigging video series.